Uh, my name is Mick Renaisen. I'm the director of the Parks and Recreation Department for the City of Bloomington. The speed at which this opportunity presented itself, the series of steps that had to occur for this opportunity to come to fruition happened at an unbelievably quick pace. And we're thankful for that, and a lot of people should be thanked for that and, and will be throughout the course of our, our speech, uh, speeches. Uh, we officially acquired the facility May 15, 2009. That very day, we had the Adidas Boys May Basketball Tournament with 170 teams. That event generated a million, one million six hundred thousand dollars for the local economy. One of the greatest successes here is that this is a self-financed facility. That we hope, with all of the planning that's been done, all the preparation that's been done, is it will be the user fees that will go into this, not taxpayer dollars. That's an amazing accomplishment and we appreciate all the effort that all those people I mentioned earlier put in to make that a possibility. Um, what we strive for, what we've been striving for, is better government and smarter service, and this project is a testament to that effort. Uh, we are, more than anything, wanting to invest in ourselves as a community, and this project is at the forefront, along with the Beeline and so many other projects, uh, in trying to achieve that goal. I need a copy of that uh, when he said I have a great sense of humor because my wife will never believe that anybody said that. There's so many wonderful things that are happening in this community. I know we don't even, as a family that's moved here relatively lately, I know we don't even know the half of it. But I know we're learning every day and it's exciting to be a part of it. And that's what I want to kind of base my foundation off of is what Bloomington was able to give to me. Bloomington was able to give a base for me to build off of my whole life and now I'm in a position where I want to give back and show these kids that people care about you, not only when you're young, but you can come back to Bloomington 30 years from now and still see the same people, still have the same places to go. So I came back this weekend definitely to be a part of this and be a part of this community and let you know that I'll never forget where I came from and I'll always love this town. More than a year ago, Parks and Recreation Department recognized um, and the board recognized that this facility was a community asset and needed to remain as such. I know the varied and lively activities will continue and program offerings will expand with the reopening of the Twin Lakes Recreation Center. I must commend the Parks, Depart Parks and Recreation Department staff for all the hard work they've put in the last couple of months. The facility looks great.